Hi Leo, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it, Leo. Thank you, God, for blessing Leo with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's see what this week is about for my Leo. Just okay, we got the King of Wands, so that could be you, Leo. The advice, the king of coins. Wow. Okay. And let's see. The outcome is the temperance. Very nice. Good energy. Okay, so you're expecting something. You put something out there. You're expecting it to come back to boomerang. You have done the work, the maybe even the magic. Some of you have done like some um, magic work, some potions, uh, maybe even water magic here. Um You've, you've done something by the water too. Maybe you went to the water and you, you put something out there. Uh, some of you are trying to compromise with someone, um, someone who's very dynamic. Um, if you have some money issues or if you're doing something with business or you have a business or business deals, it looks like it's going to go well with the King of Wands and the King of Coins here. Um, this week is about leadership taking a leadership role, uh, being dynamic, uh, putting yourself out there. You could be dealing with the Sagittarius. You don't have to be, but you could be. Um, it's about maybe starting that new business, being an entrepreneur, organizing people, delegating, putting things together, um, looking at the larger scope, the larger picture here. You have a big, um, big world view or big picture type of mindset. You don't sweat the small stuff, the details. Um, you hire people for that. <laughs> the king of pentacles is the advice here. It says that um, if you're doing something where you make something with your hand or you're doing, or you do work where you use your hands or you make something or you create something or you sew something or you bind something together or you sculpt something or you, I don't know, whatever it is you do, you fix things. Um, it's going to do very well. Um, you wouldn't make a lot of money or you could make a lot of money. Um, something about assembly. Uh, you need to assemble something or you need to be in, there needs to be organization. There needs to be structure here. Um, some of you don't have that, but it looks like you need to get in a place where there is organization and structure so that there can be growth. Like in the, all this green, the king of coins here. There could be some man that comes into your life that gives you really, really good advice that you would um, be wise to use it or at least to listen. Um, he may not be as romantic as you want this person to be, but he's dedicated. He's loyal. He has money. He's done a lot by his own hand, getting himself here as the king of pentacles where his money works for him. He makes money in his sleep. Um, therefore, he can give good advice about um, enterprise, assembly, something about assembly line. I don't know. Um, it's like you have the big world view, but then here's somebody who's going to help ground that energy, that King of Wands energy, ground it and give you some real advice, maybe even money, maybe even, uh, invest or, uh, yeah, help here. With the temperance as the outcome, it looks like you come to some happy compromise about something, or someone, um, yeah, with the temperance here, it looks like, um, something was out of balance, something was out of order, there was a disconnect, there was discord between you and somebody else, but there's compromise, I don't know if you're getting back together, but there's definitely where we can level with one another, we can be rational, we can talk, uh, we can keep conversation to a minimum, but we definitely can talk now. We can be more civil. Something about being civilized and um, more rational. Uh, compromising with someone. Um, helping also. Them helping you or you helping them. Tempering your emotions. Understanding that you don't have to always um, go to the deep end. Be in the middle. Because the tempers talks about the middle ground. Some of you are trying to temper out your emotions and your mental. Some of you, there is some mental issue and there's nothing to be um, ashamed about that. Address it, 
take medication or whatever it is you need to do um, and move forward. Uh, there is some, some mental issue, especially for some man here. Some of you want, you definitely want your business to expand here. Yeah, you want your business to expand. You want um, something about global enterprise taking over. Um, again, taking a leadership role, showing other people the way and how to do something. How to start something new. A really good reading for you, uh, Leo. I hope that it resonated for you. If it did go over, some of you dealing with somebody who was married. Okay. They're married, but they're, they're making some type of appeal to you. Like, look, I'm married, but this is what I can offer. This is what I'll do. Or this is what, you know, so they're making some type of appeal to you. And they're waiting for your answer. Um, go over to the website, book there at, uh, get your own reading. You can ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can find me here live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. You can ask questions on the live, or you can just come for the collective reading. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy ale or coffee link. Thank you, guys. Many blessings to you. Take care.